Alright, Fuzz Pie Guy here. I had some questions about the uh, my uh, smart relay here that has a Wi Fi uh, ESP on it. Uh, you can pick these up offline. <clears throat> you got your common, normally closed, normally open. You can power it here from 5 volts or here from uh, 5 volts. So I just used the micro USB to make it simple. Uh, <clears throat> then I just have this hooked up, as you can see in my previous video. Uh, I have this hooked up to just a pair of uh, car horns. So I have the uh, ground coming out of the uh, horn going right to the ground of the 12 volt power supply. Then the uh, <clears throat> power coming from the power supply goes to the common to the relay. Then I have the horn hooked into the normally open since we want it open until we tell the relay to close so the uh, horn will blow so <clears throat> back to that uh, when you get these you could just plug them in and you can hear the relay come on and off and stuff and uh, it'll come with a little instruction on how to set this up but uh, you uh, can go to the app store I'm not sure if this is supported on Android which I would think it probably is but uh, you want to download an app called we e we link then uh, once you have it installed, you'll just want to come down here and uh, click on the uh, plus. Then it'll walk you through on how to uh, set this up. And you just want to hit next. You don't want to do the GSM thing. And it's pretty simple. You put in your password for your uh, Wi-Fi and everything. So I have this already hooked up. So if we... Uh, if I just click this here, if I can move my hand out of the way, you can see um, it coming on and off. And down here, as you can see, you can uh, set up a schedule, a timer, and, and all that. Now this is the app that you'll need to uh, set up the device now in order to get this to work with Alexa <clears throat> you'll need to pull up your Alexa app and uh, what we'll do is under devices you'll just want to add A device then you can scroll down and we'll just say switch then there's e we link so just follow the instruction on it and uh, you should get an icon when you click on like uh, devices you should get an icon that says uh, switches now the thing is you can click on this and go up here to your settings and rename this to whatever you like I think default would be switch or relay or whatever so <clears throat> I have it titled horn so if we just you know that that will turn it on now if you want this on for a long period of time if you hit that button right there 
this one here that will keep it on all the time until you turn it off obviously we don't want that for this uh, purpose of the horn so <clears throat> with that said I have this plugged in the 5 volts and we'll plug in the power supply for the horn So as you can see, I have my power supply hooked up here and we can just hit this button and it'll blow or <clears throat> we can go through and uh, If we go under your Amazon Alexa app and go to skills, you can download eWe Link right there. Just uh, click on that and set it up. Then uh, you can. Uh, tell her to uh, turn on the horn so if we go Alexa turn on the horn okay. and there we have it so it works out pretty well so That's it. They make these in, uh, you can get ones that have more relays on the same board and everything. So, this is just a generic one. So, alright. Thanks for watching and hopefully this helps out a little bit on uh, maybe how to set this up and, and what not. So, I'll give you a little close up here of this so alright thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next one